Well, we're back. And I've done as my new friend Hadvar instructed, and I searched around and I found some gear, and we're doing much better than we were before, looking much better than we were before. Um, one thing about Sam, there's that dragon again, one thing about Sam that I want to point out before we continue on, you'll see that I've picked up an Imperial helmet. You are not going to see Sam wear this helmet or any helmet ever because although Sam may not have much hair, he spends a lot of time on it. He is royalty after all, let's not forget. And there's nothing he hates more than helmet hair. So just FYI, no helmet now, no helmet ever. And that dragon's really tearing it up out there. Anyway, <laughs> we should we should probably continue on. Um, and uh, you will be seeing me use a sword. Um, if I had to put a class on Sam, um, I would say he is a spell sword. Um, so I will be using sword in one hand, spell in the other, mostly conjuration. That's what you're going to be seeing me use mostly. Conjuration, alteration, things like that. In fact, well, no, in fact, nothing. Um, also, I'm going to do one quick thing really quickly. Uh, I'm going to set up a group. A group that is just my sword and an empty hand. So that I can switch back to being able to block. Because I will not be using a shield, obviously. That way we should be able to now... Oh, if I can press the correct keys, we should be able to equip that there. Conjure something, and then I should be able to just switch to the group. And now we have just a sword. You see that? I will lose a very valuable second, but that's okay. Uh, I'm also going to hotkey that to number four, I think. Yeah. No way I can just... There we go. And then group. Just the sword block. Okay. Beautiful. Anyway, Hadvar. Yes, I'm coming. You probably want to get out of here. I want to get out of here, too. Let's go. Um, okay, there's guys in there, uh, Hadvar. Um, there's guys... Yeah. Yeah, I... That's what I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> reason with them, really. You do realize you're an Imperial, right? Hold on now. We only want to. Okay. Now, well, this is clearly gone awry, so. That going. Get them! No more! Okay! Oh my lord, that looks. very painful. And also. see if I can get that door open. It also looked kinda awesome. For me, I just want to take a second to point that out. What do you got? You've got storm cloak, hide, cloak. Well, I'll take it. I don't think I'm gonna wear it. Oh, you've got fur gauntlets. That's good. Shields, ha! Shields are for sissies. Um. Oh, also, I want to activate. Value per weight, yes, ah. Um, none of this is very valuable. I'll take the shield. I'm going to take it, but I'm going to sell it. I'm not going to use it. And you can keep your mace. It's not very valuable. I'm coming. Relax. 
But see, these, look at that. 20, and they only weigh one. I'll take it. Iron greatsword? No, thank you. Okay. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Yes, I'm coming, Hadvar, for frick's sake, man. I got... I got gloves. I need to put them on. All right, I'm ready now. Also, hang on. I want to try something, Hadvar. Just don't mind me. I'm going to stand in one place awkwardly for a little bit. Oh, darn it. No, don't do that. Also, I don't think that changed my field of view. That's fine. I'll deal with that later. Never mind. Never mind the fourth wall breaking down. Miss. Okay. Okay. The hell. Damn, that dragon doesn't give up easy. I guess not. We need to get out of hell now. These Imperials have potions in here. Go to me. Okay, those guys seem pretty unhappy with us, so. Alright, one down. Get him! Get him! Oh! Right in the gut. Alright. I know a store. See if you can find some potions. Might come in handy. Okay, potions. Good idea. That's good thinking. First, I'm going to pick up all this other more pricey stuff. Stuff that I can sell. Thinking ahead, Hadvar. That's what you do when you're royalty and not a smelly Nord like you. You think ahead, sir. But potions are good, too. You, 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 you were right about that. Excuse me, wolf. Oh, my God. You're, you're very annoying. Did you know that? Oh. Is there gold in the cupboard did I see? Yes, I'll take that. Gold is even better than finding things to sell. Because I can just immediately purchase things. Oh, they just have these... They just have these rabbit and... Pheasants hung out here. I'll take that too. Why not? Cook them up later. Oh my lord, all of that, please. What else? Apples, sure. Tomatoes, yeah, all right. More apples. We are the kings of the apples, Hadvar. We are. Oh. All right. Done then? Yeah, I this think we're way. good. I think we're good. I'm ready to Ready to move on. You won't alive. Oh, I... <laughs> Torture. Sounds like we found a battle already. Come on. Get in there, Wolfie. Yes, get them. Yes. It's very dark in here. Yeah, he's down. Yes, get him. how I've been entertaining their comrades. Well, that's not very nice at all, sir. A dragon is attacking Helgen. Anybody who refers to torture as entertainment is Hunt. definitely not right in the head. Dragon, please, don't make up nonsense. We're not making up nonsense. Oh, this guy has two. A cape and a cloak. That's interesting. Okay. Oh, they'll come to think of it. I did hear some iron, iron mace coming from over there. Come with us. We need to get out of here. Brief history of the Empire, Volume Two, huh? All right. Didn't you hear me? I said the keep is under us. You'll have to excuse me a moment, ladies and gentlemen. The volume for this seems quite loud indeed. I don't understand. Let me turn the voices down. I think a little bit. Everything seems really loud. Let's try that. Wait a second. Looks like there's something in this. Cage. Okay, Wolf, get out Don't of the way. With that. Lost the key ages ago. Poor fellow's breathing. 
See if you can get it open with some pace. You really are Wait, a terrible person. You know that? Shu, take all my things. Please. Book of the Dragonborn. All right. Sounds interesting. Perhaps we'll read that later. I'm taking this, taking this book. I don't care if you mind or not, because you're you're an evil man. What's in here? Another potion and some lockpicks. How convenient. Weren't you just saying I should try and pick this? Better yet. Better yet. Check this out, man. I don't need to pick it. I can use magic. Aha! Search mage. Oh, look at the... Okay, yeah, I'll take all of that. Looks like he's got some gold down here, too. Minor magicka. Sparks! Spell tome, okay. Don't know if I'm gonna learn that or not. But I might. I might. Another novice lock. Is there anything in here that's useful? I can't really see. We'll find out. Alright. Don't really see anything. I'm just going to open all these. You don't mind, right? You said you don't mind. And nothing. Okay, that's fine. I'm ready, Hadvar. Let's go. Let's continue on. Apparently there's no way out this way, but you know what? Screw that guy. We're going to check anyway. You know what I could use is a freaking torch. I can't see a dang thing. You got a torch on you, Hadvar? Yes? No? Maybe? Oh, I think... I think I see a bag of coins in there. I should probably hotkey open locks. That would make things a lot easier. All right. It just automatically opens, huh? That's very fancy how I do that. Skeleton, bone meal, and gold. Well, I'll take the gold. I don't know what the heck I would do with bone meal. That seems pretty useless. All right, Hadvar, I'm ready now. Let's go. Oh, that is a lot. That is a lot of flashing blood. Just, wow. Um. <laughs> oh, man. And he bled in perfect squares. That's so weird. I don't need your ragged robes. This way. Oh, is that where we're going, you think? Yeah, all right. Through the giant opening in the wall, huh? Did you find that all on your own? Huh? Yeah, I hear voices. You might want to... You might want to come up here and... Help me by soaking up some damage. Wow, it is loud in here. Yeah. Get him. Oh, I'm getting hit now. That's not good. I don't like that. Yes, get them! Aha! Somebody's shooting arrows at us. That's not good. Oh, I don't have enough magicka. Yes, shoot them back, Hadbar. Shoot them back. Die! Oh, just die already. Right. Got him. Nice job. It's very loud in here. I'm going to see if I can do something about that. Sorry about this, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to take some time to get this stuff right. Let's turn waterfalls and rapids just all the way down. Let's do that. See if that helps. Nope. Still louder than hell. All right, that's fine. 
Ooh. Nah, I'm not taking that. Sorry. Keep your stupid shield. I don't want it. I will take these. All of these cloaks, though. Because why not? Ooh, a bow. Ooh. That might be useful. I don't know. Sam's not much of an archer, but... Still, uh, a good bow could come in handy. You never know. Oh my god. You, did you know you were the most nagging person in history? God dang. I'm just stopping to pick up a few bits of gear, man. Relax. Come on, this way. Let's go. God. Let's see what this goes. It looks like it goes to a wood barrier. That's where it looks like it goes. Oh. Taking care of that, are you? All right. Thanks. Oh, God. Okay. I really can't hear you because the waterfalls are terribly loud. I'm sorry again, you guys. I just, I gotta try and fix that. It's awful. I'm, I might have to change my mods around. Because that is, I just I can't take that. What if we turn ambiance off? Does that do anything? Nope, waterfalls are still loud as hell. Okay. What setting controls waterfalls? You would think it'd be waterfalls and rapids. You know, which is right there. Apparently that's not it. Is it effects? Okay, it's effects. That's not good because effects are pretty much the entire game audio. All right, in that case, we're just going to turn it down to there and see if that is any better. Yeah, that's a little better. I'll have to leave it there, I guess. By the way, Hadvar, I'm going this way anyway, because I know something you don't know. Yeah. And three more right there. Oh, and a health potion. Nice. Oh, and look, there just happens to be this convenient way through right here. Haha. -ha. Oh, what? Hi. I'm ready now. No, it doesn't. I guess we better try this one. Yeah, guess we better. Yep. And thank you very much. Hi. You don't have to keep stopping every time. I'm right here. I mean, I know I was just a prisoner a few minutes ago, but really, I'm fine. Okay. I Listen, dude, I see... Yeah, I see spiders in there. You might want to prepare yourself uh, for that. Yeah. All right. I got one. Aha. Get him. Oh, nice kill there, dude. Nice kill. What next? The giant snakes. J please. Don't even say giant snakes, man. If giant snakes come, I'm I'm running. I just want you to know, I'm out of here. Yeah. I'm not going to hang around for giant Snakes. No. No way. Not a fan of snakes. At all. So you can forget about that. Where are we now? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I mean, what what did you say it was a a, a bear? No, we're we're not we're not fighting a bear. Screw that. I would like to get this bag of coins though. All right, there we go. Oh, and wine. I'll take wine. Yes, sir. 
Definitely like me a bit of wine every now and then. You know what I mean, Advar? All right, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna sneak by it, huh? All right. I'm gonna try to make things a little bit less loud, though, Advar. I'm sorry. That's a little better. All right. Okay, this seems to be working so far. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, she's awake. She's awake. You think we're far enough? Ah, that was close. Yeah. Yes, it was. Thanks for the tip about being quiet when you're near a sleeping bear. That was very useful. This looks like the way out. You think so? I was starting to wonder if we'd ever make it. Really? I mean, really, yes, so was I. Ah, all right. Oh, God, there it is. Oh, God, okay. I think it flew away, I think. Looks like he's gone for good this time. You think? I hope but you're I right about that. Stick around to see if he comes back. Yeah. The closest town from here is Riverwood. My uncle's the blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. You think? It's probably best if we split up. Yeah, no. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Yeah, we're not splitting up, Hadvar. Definitely not. So you forget about that. I'm keeping you in my line of sight. For sure. When did it start raining, by the way? Ah, well, whatever. Listen. You should put out the fires, probably, huh? I don't think that that dragon was... I don't think Ulfric and the rebels brought that dragon. I mean, why would they do that? That's crazy. You know what I mean? What, who is shooting? I hear people shooting, Hadvar. We might want to be careful. All right. So how far is this town, anyway? What did you say the name of it was? Riverwood? Where's See it at? ruin up there. What? Bleak Falls Barrow. When I was a boy, that place always used to give me nightmares. Why? Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. That kind of thing. No. Oh. I admit, I still don't much like the look of it. Yeah. I suppose it does have a bit of an ominous look to it, but it's not really anything to be scared of. It's just a bunch of it's just a bunch of stone, really, isn't it? Ah. Uh. Oh. Guardian stones, stones discovered. Stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead, see for yourself. All right, I guess we got time. I suppose I could check it out. Activate the thief stone. All right. Activate the mage stone. Activate. The Warrior Stone. Well, this is interesting. I'm not really sure which one of these I want to take, actually. I definitely think that, as a character, Sam is going to want to have probably either the Atronach Stone or the Lord Stone, possibly. But until I can find those... I'm not really sure. If I took the Mage Stone, I would level up my Mage abilities more. Conjuration and Alteration and Restoration, things like that. Or I could level up my basically probably just one-handed if I take this. I think one-handed is probably going to level up itself on its own pretty quickly. So I think for right now... I think I'm going to take the mage. 
Those under the sign of the mage will learn all magic skills 20% faster. We only have one sign blessing at a time, except sign yes. Okay. Here we go, the mage. All right. I'm all done. You can head out now. Oh, you didn't, you weren't real impressed by that. Were you? Taking the mage stone. Yeah, I didn't think you would be. Whatever, I don't care. So what? I like my spells, Hadvar. Deal with it. So really, how 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 far is this place, Listen, dude? As far as I'm concerned, you've already heard your part. Okay. But until we get that confirmed by General Tullius, just stay clear of other Imperial soldiers. Oh, I'm definitely gonna do that. Yeah. I'm not gonna go anywhere near any Imperials. You can believe that, dude. Or any soldiers, really, for that matter. I don't... I don't need that kind of trouble anymore. That's that's as close as I ever want to get to, uh... to a headman's axe. Believe me. There's some wolves up there. So, you know, you might want to be careful. I'm glad you decided to come with me. Yeah? We're almost to river. I'm glad I decided to go with you, too. Believe me. We're almost there, you say, huh? All right. Why are you going so slow? And I'm going so fast. That's very strange. I think I'm just going to kind of run ahead of you. I think I've figured out where Riverwood is. Yeah. This must be the place. Riverwood discovered. All right. You better go ahead, because I don't know any of these people. Things look quiet enough here. Come on, there's my uncle. All right. Well, that's right. You said your uncle was going to help me. Uncle Alvar, hello. Huh. Dragons now, is it? Please, my what are you doing? If you keep on like this, everyone in town will you're crazy. Yeah, she's not crazy. There's definitely a dragon, dude. Relax. Keep your voice down. I'm fine. But we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? Hi, how you doing? He's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. What? Come I mean, on, I'll explain I mean, everything, but we need to go inside. I didn't really save his life. Okay, I don't know why okay. he said that. Come inside, then. Sigrid will get you something to eat, and you can tell me all about it. Okay. All right. Which house is yours? I'm gonna guess it's this one, because that's where your your smithy is. But who knows? You know, I could be wrong. It is here, isn't it? Okay, well, that's good. All right. Alvor and Sigrid's house. Sigrid, we have company. Hello. Hello there, little girl. How you doing? That's fine. You don't need to say hi. That's very I'm disrespectful. So That's you. fine. Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you some. Hungry? I don't really think so. Now then, boy. What's the big mystery? What are you doing here? But I'll have a like seat, though. Thank you. Argument with a cave bear. I don't know where to stop. You know I was assigned to General Tullius' goal. We were stopped in Helgen when we were attacked by a dragon. Yep. A dragon? That's ridiculous it's true though you are drunk are you boy i don't think Husband, he is let him tell his story i do have some wine on me Not though much you want some tell. this dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place mass confusion i don't know if anyone else got out alive i doubt i'd made it out myself if not for my friend here oh well, there he goes again i, I don't really know what i did know what's but happened. i thought you could help us out Food, supplies, a place to stay. Yeah, that'd be nice. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. Well, thank you. I'm glad to help however I can. Okay. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. But I need your help. Um, we need your help. All right. Well, uh, okay. With I guess I could try and help you. Really, really what I need? I mean, this is all... This is all very nice. Ooh, a tent. I'll, uh, yeah, I'll have that. Um, and the food. Fur boots. I don't really think I need, but thank you. Ooh, honey nut treat. That sounds delicious. 
Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> a little mead for later. Yeah, all right. Iron ingot? Um, I don't think I need that. You know what? I'm taking it. Um, Nord mead. Again, thank you, Alvor. Um, I, I'll wait until, you know, later to have it, but thank you. Healing potions, an apple, silver ring. All right. That's all a, that's all a big help, Hadvar. What, what I really could use, though, is... Really, I just uh, like a ticket for the first carriage back to High Rock. You could just hook me up with that. That that would be great. You know, I'll just go home. I think you guys, you know, you'll be fine. I mean, a dragon, one dragon, whatever. It's not a big deal. Somebody will kill it. You got, you got, you know, heavily armed heroes type people here. You know, I mean, hell, you've got a war going on. You know, you've got two armies, really, of people that you can send against the dragon that we saw. He's, he's big, but he's, 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 well, he's big. But yeah, he can be killed, for sure, for, for sure. He, I, 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 he, he must be able to, to be. So, yep, I'll, I'll be on my way back to, to High Rock then. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get Kay. word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. No, oh, okay. So, so, so here's what I heard, uh, Alvor. W what I'm hearing you saying is, you you can't really help me get back to High Rock right now. It's 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 not something. You're able to do what what you're saying is is I should go talk to this Jarl uh, Balgruff in White Run and and certainly you know he's he's a man of royalty obviously he has the means surely to help me get back home um, so yeah what, what can you tell me about the Jarl by the way Jarl Balgruff. He rules Whiterun whole. Mm, yes. A good man. Yes. Perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. He sounds very important. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last, though. Hmm. So which side of the war is he favoring, then? I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Ellis of much. Okay. Who can blame him? Right. But I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. No traitor. Yeah. That's what I that's what I do too, and that's what we are doing in High Rock, as unfortunate as it may be. You know, the Empire's the Emperor. Uh Empire's the Empire, rather. You know, better to stick with it and try and clean it up than fight amongst ourselves. You know what I mean? Of course. Skyrim has always been part of the Empire. Mm-hmm. That doesn't mean I support everything the Empire's been doing lately. Of course not. That's silly. But Nords have never been fair-weather friends. Right. Okay. So, so who's Elisif, then? If, if I'm not mistaken, I'm going to ask you this anyway, but if I'm not mistaken, Elisif was uh, King Torig's wife, right? The, the High King of Skyrim. Ah. I forget you're new to Skyrim. Yeah, I am. It's Jarl true. Jarl Elisif, I should say. Ah. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torig yeah. when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torig, you know. Holy shit, Walked really? Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Damn. Shouted him to death, if you believe the stories. That does sound crazy. That's what started this whole war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. Once the Jarls start killing each other, we're back to the bad old days. Yeah, that's true. So, uh, what do you think about the war, then? People are rightly stirred up about the damn Talmor being allowed to roam around arresting people. Yeah, I agree. Just for worshipping Talos. Yeah. But was it worth tearing Skyrim apart? Probably maybe not. destroying the Empire? Probably not. No. Ulfric will have a lot to answer for in the end. Yeah. Nords have always supported the Empire. And the Empire has always been good for Skyrim. That's true. It's been good for for all the provinces, really. 
Um, so why are the Thalmor allowed to arrest people for worshipping Talos? If I'm not mistaken, it's because of the white gold concordat that was signed in Cyrodiil. But, uh, but, but go ahead and give me your thoughts on it, Alvor. It's from that treaty that ended the Great War, yeah. remember? Yep. When the Emperor was forced by the Thalmor to outlaw Talos worship, mm -hmm. we didn't pay much attention to it when I was a boy. Everyone still had their little shrine to Talos. But then, Ulfric and his sons of Skyrim started agitating about it. And sure enough, the Emperor had to crack down. Yeah. Dragging people off in the middle of the night. One of the main causes of this war, if you ask me. Yeah, that was probably a mistake, right? It was probably a misstep for the elves, too, if you think about it. I mean, they could have just let it be and grown their power base and took more and more direct control over the Empire and everything would have been fine. Nobody really would have noticed the things that they were losing. Why they chose to go ahead and start directly attacking Talos worshippers, that's, that's an interesting question. I got to agree with you there, Alvor. Um, so... What can you tell me about this town, Riverwood? Gerder's family first settled here as woodcutters a few generations ago. She and Hod run the mill. I make a decent living sharpening axes and fixing the sawmill. All right. Sounds okay, I guess. Uh, so how do I get to Whiterun then from here? Cross the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. Right. When you get to White Run, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Right, and then he's going to be able to, to help me out, right? I mean, with getting back home. Right, okay. Well, all right, Alvor. Thanks a lot for everything. You two, um, Sigrid, Sigrid. Thank you, Sigrid, and... Rude little child who couldn't even say hi to me. Um, yeah, thank you, I guess, too, for for nothing. All right, guys. All right, then. Did you see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? Well, well Sam. You two make yourselves at home. We survived a dragon attack. Somehow. Really. I think... Hadvar over there was the hero. He seems to want to prop me up as saving his life, but let's be honest, without him It's nice to be back in a friendly I surely would have died out there. Listen, I'm going to lay up here for a while. Alright. You can make your own way to solitude from here. I'm not going to I'd solitude. Heading to White Run, just down the road from here. From there you can take a carriage to solitude. Okay, yeah, I'm not can going to solitude. Okay, I'm going outside. Get away from these rude people who won't stop talking. And go out in the nice Skyrim rain. And hope that this Jarl of Whiterun will be able to help us to get back home. I have a feeling probably not. But that's not going to stop me from trying. 